Hey guys, Joe here. So a little while back I posted a topic on slinging.org for the egg challenge that we do every spring. And nobody did it, including me. So I'm going to try to fix that today. I've got a carton of Easter eggs. And these were ones that were dyed. I ate a whole bunch that we made. But some are always left over because I get sick of eating eggs. So our first target, hopefully, that gets destroyed. My sister always makes a, a pink egg for Bret Hart. I don't know if that's showing up. So the Hitman's going to be our first destruction. <laughs> but what I'm going to do, as you can see, I've got my target set up here. It's just at 13 meters. But I've got this spike. This is the same one that I used for uh, AA's coin challenge. But I switched it off to a cup on the top here. So I'm going to put the egg in the cup like that and put it up against the target and then I'm gonna sling a tennis ball at it and see if I can smash a hard-boiled egg a refrigerated hard-boiled egg with a tennis ball like I said just at 13 meters so not too far but uh, because this is round uh, you know like a glancing hit isn't gonna do anything it's just gonna bump this off I'm gonna have to hit that basically dead on and even then I don't know if a tennis ball is gonna break it or not hopefully I get one and we'll find out I'll go set this up I don't know how well it's showing up, but right before I start here, I'll take the camera up there and show it. Um, that egg is just real short, like maybe about an eighth of an inch off the board. All right, let's see if I can break that thing. Just a note. I'm only looking for one break here, but I know if I just bump that egg off or get kind of a glancing hit, it might get a crack in it. If that happens, I'll switch and I'll swap it out because I am looking for a nice smash of the egg. Let's do it. There's a stick. <laughs> See if I can get this on camera. <sighs> yeah, there the sun's hitting it real well. I did get a crack. Alrighty. Goodbye, Mr. Hart. <laughs> the angle's pretty too low on the camera. That thing got up into the yard and basically blew apart. All right, let me grab another egg. All right, next up we got a nice neon green here. Make sure that's showing up here. Oh yeah, real nice.
Oh, so close. All right, guys, we got another crack. And this one is absolutely from the ball hit. You can see the ball impact right there, the circle spot. And we got a crack around. Crack around it. But that is not a splattered egg, so we're still going. Goodbye, green egg. Green eggs and ham flying away. I know someone out there is thinking, oh, you should try to hit the egg with the egg. No. <laughs> All right. I believe this one, let me show you a good shot of it first. I'm not positive, but I believe this one was an attempt to dye a brown, an egg, a brown egg, an egg that was already brown. But I'm not positive. Let me see if I can smash it and we'll find out. See, one thing, when one's that close, like four inches, maybe five inches, I'm not a good enough slinger to make that adjustment. So for me, that's just the same throw and hope for the best, because I can't adjust it that small of a, that small of a distance. There's a stick. Three eggs busted. <laughs> you can see this one. That was right where it was sitting down in that uh, little, that little cupboard, that little cup's rubber. It's actually a stopper. But uh, that smashed the bottom right there. So just, I was low, about an inch, not I had it. Blast, blast, blast. All right. Goodbye, weird purple egg. Right. This one's going to make the target a little tougher. Here we've got a nice... Sort of a neon blue kind of color. But this egg's pretty thin. That last one was... Well, maybe not a quarter inch, but it was a little bit wider. Let's try it. Oh. <laughs> Using twenty balls or twenty one balls, I think actually. But uh I'm getting tired. <laughs> I think I can do one more bucket of twenty misses. And if I don't get it, that might be it. I don't know if I can do two more buckets. even think of it I just realized how close the camera is my head might be out of frame here <laughs> but 
but I'm not changing it now. All right, uh, yeah, this is gonna be my last bucket because I am getting tired. I'm just, the weather's been so crappy. I haven't been slinging. It's like the only time I sling during the week is when I record Channing's competition. So I'm wiping myself out this much. Out of slinging shape, guys. We'll see. This is the last plan bucket. Maybe I'll throw a few more if there's still some light. Let's go. Blue egg breaking time. Razor glands, guys. Aim for the blue egg. This one too. Cracked up all down at the bottom where it was in that cup. Okay. I blue egg. <laughs> that one just flew to pieces instantly. This time we've got kind of a a reddish brownish color this one also says Bret Hart <laughs> four broken eggs let's see if we can make it five This one's busted up pretty good, pretty good. All right. The red to Bret Hart egg. Five balls left. Maybe this will be the lucky one. You know, nice neon pinkish purplish something Oh. Number six. This is still what I wasn't wasn't what I wanted. I think this one was kind of probably facing that way, maybe like that, because I know the ball caught it kind of in the lower lower on that side, or there's cracking there. Maybe it hit it there. It was like that, and then it was. This damage is all from being pushed into the target a little bit. Oh well, this one's gone. Alright, 
the sun is down behind that and you guys can see that the sun's not showing on the yard up there anymore I didn't get that hit so close so many times I think I hit the the right side of the egg twice and hit the cup twice then I think the other two were stick stick bounce breaks but I know what you're saying we didn't get to see an egg smash on the target let me see if I can fix that Booyah. <laughs> Diana. <laughs> All right. <laughs> happy egg challenge, everyone. It's late, but happy Easter, Ostara, and spring. Cheers, guys.